Hey YouTube, it's Jobin. I got some Mora knives in stock. I just got these in, I don't mind telling you, from Ragweed Forge. Um, a really nice guy who runs that uh, definitely uh, deserves our support. I don't mind redirecting you to him. Obviously, I would appreciate it if you would order something from me. But particularly, uh, he has a much larger stock than I do. Good guy, good prices. A much larger selection, I mean. At this time, I only have these four. Uh, so, uh, definitely check him out. Um, I'm going to try to get these up soon on my eBay store. And I haven't really talked about this yet. Um, but, edcsource.com. But if you want one before I get around to that, just send me an email or something. And so basically what I did is I picked four models, well, two models basically, that I considered some of the best general purpose Mora knives. And I got uh, ten in carbon steel and ten in stainless of each of them. I can't remember the exact model numbers. I'm going to enter them down below because... Um, they just completely dropped out of my head just now. Uh, but this one has a sort of softish rubber feeling handle with nice texturing. A uh, good sheath retention. And so I got them in carbon, stainless over here. Uh, this one I do remember the name of. This is the Model 511. Uh, this is the carbon one. I've been carrying one of these strapped to the bottom of my EDC pack for ages. It is just a great, great knife for bushcraft type stuff. And so I've got that, and then it's uh, it's brother with a different handle color. Same knife, but in stainless steel. So I'm going to have these up for sale soon. And uh, if you're interested in more knives that I don't have yet, definitely check out Ragweed Forge. So this is Jobin for Lazy Lizard Gear saying it is 7 after 1. Do you know where your knife is? Catch you later, guys.